The following is a presentation of Roadrunners All Access. Bautista going to Gutierrez, gets a shot and it's a goal! What a shot from Jaime Gutierrez! Men's soccer forward Jaime Gutierrez is a goal scorer through and through. From his elaborate celebrations to the smoothness of his game, the junior from Aurora has a gift for finding the back of the net. He learned the game of soccer from his dad, who was a talented player in his own right. I remember just ever since I can walk, like my dad would always just kind of like be there, kind of like pushing the ball against me or like just kicking, making me kick the ball and just as hard as, as, hard as I could back then. But uh, yeah, my dad loved the game. My dad um, is an amazing player himself. He still plays every now and then. <laughs> he developed the love of the game from outside his front door. But yeah, that's when the love kind of comes from the streets pretty much. I remember just growing up in the streets of, of Juarez, Mexico. That's where I, I started playing the most. Jaime grew up actually playing goalkeeper and loved making game-saving stops in front of his cousins. However, when he played for his first team in Denver, they already had a keeper. So uh, they put me out on the field. I was playing midfielder, I think. And uh, I mean, I was pretty good with the ball, but I remember that first game I scored a goal. <laughs> and that's when I was like, okay, I, maybe I like being out, out in the field more than goalkeeper. <laughs> His natural goal scoring ability brought him to MSU Denver to play collegiate soccer. It didn't take him long to show Roadrunner fans what was in store for the next four years. To the side in front of us, Sends in a nice through ball, gets to Gutierrez, Gutierrez, lobs it, and it's a goal for the Roadrunners! And I remember when I was uh, like when I, in the game, I was there, uh, I was just like, oh, okay, I'm in front of the goalkeeper, like I have to score this, you know, because it was like my, I think it was my second game as, as a college player. And I was like, I need to get some goals down, but, so I was like thinking of just like slotting and try to hit as hard as I can. But then like I look up and I see the goalkeeper kind of like rushing me a little bit. So I was like, I have to chip him. <laughs> so I go for the chip and um, I chip it over him and it goes in. And um, I just, that's all I remember because the rest, I was just so happy. Jaime scored eight goals in his first season and was named the Rocky Mountain Athletic Conference's Freshman of the Year. In two seasons in downtown Denver, Jaime has scored 12 goals donning that Roadrunner jersey. I mean, I, I always know I could score, but I mean, doing it in college just kind of proved to me once again that I, I can do good things when I'm, when I'm playing confidently. So then after that, I just knew that I had to continue to tell myself I can do it every single game and the goals kept coming, so it was good. Whether he's scoring with his feet or whether he's using his 6'2 height, Jaime has the ability to make goalkeepers look silly. The biggest uh, reason for why I scored a couple goals with my head is because I'm pretty tall. Because uh, my aerial game with my he like my heading is definitely uh, something that I need to work on, I think. Okay. Although I scored a couple goals, I think it's, some it's one of my personal weaknesses. Even his penalty kick game has keepers flustered. And when I walk up, I'm keeping my eyes on the, goal on the goalkeeper. Uh, so I never move my eyes away from, from the goalkeeper. I'm looking him dead on in the eyes. And then um, as I'm walking up, just as soon as I'm about to strike, the goalkeeper is either going to move to one side or he's going to stay in the middle. So as soon as I see him move, I just kind of go the opposite way. And uh, if he doesn't move, then I just try to place it to, to a corner and he's never going to get there because he didn't move. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> he has also knocked in four game-winning goals in his short but exciting career so far. None more exciting than perhaps his netter versus CSU Pueblo. Right foot. Bouncing around, still loose, back foot and into the net, and the Roadrunners win. And guess who? Number 13, the freshman. It's Jaime Gutierrez. It was just very exciting because uh, everybody kind of rushed in the field, and we had a pretty big crowd that night. So I remember everybody just being so happy, and then uh, the coach just like gives me a big hug at the end. He was just so happy that we got the win. And, um, yeah, my parents were there. I think that night uh, a lot of my friends came out, so it was nice to have them there as well. And if you're going to be a goal scorer, then the post-goal celebration is a must. On one evening against South Dakota Mines, Jaime literally pulled out one of the most memorable celebrations in Roadrunners history. I think it was our homecoming game, and then uh, we had a penalty kick, and uh, I asked, uh, I think DB was, or Danny Bautista, he was gonna take it, and then I asked him if I could take it. <laughs> and uh, he's like, yeah, I go for it. So um, I put it away, and then uh, I had a mask prepped that night, and so I pulled out the mask and put it on, and, uh, and the rest is history. <laughs> when I scored it, I was 
I was just like I, I was hesitant. I was like, should I put it on? Should I not? Because like I was thinking I was gonna like I was gonna get booked for it, and I, I did end up getting the yellow card. But I mean, <laughs> I think I think it was probably worth it. So what did his coach say after seeing the mask? He just said, don't do it again. <laughs> Jaime Gutierrez says he's constantly working on his craft, and once COVID-19 finally subsides, he'll be able to put his goal-scoring abilities back on display for his opponents on the other side of the pitch and for his dad sitting in the crowd. This has been a presentation of Roadrunners All Access.